Also in Texas this morning, police are holding a soldier they say has confessed to plotting an attack at Fort Hood, the same army base where 13 people were killed in 2009. This time, a call from a store clerk may have prevented a second tragedy. CBS News Justice correspondent Bob Orr has more. Private First Class Nasser Abdo has made no secret of his contempt for the U.S. Army. The 21-year-old American-born Muslim last year refused to fight in what he called an unjust war in Afghanistan. I refused to go to Afghanistan uh, because it was against my Islamic conditions. He accused the Army of trumping up charges that he possessed child pornography. And three weeks ago, he went AWOL from Fort Campbell, Kentucky. But on Tuesday, his anger took a more ominous turn when he surfaced at a gun shop in Texas, bought six pounds of gunpowder, and asked a strange question. What is smokeless powder? If you don't know what it is, why would you buy six pounds of it? Police arrested Abdo at this nearby motel with a room full of bomb parts, gunpowder, a pressure cooker, batteries, clocks, a 40 caliber semi-automatic handgun, and more than 100 rounds of ammunition. Sources say Abdo has told investigators he wanted to attack soldiers from nearby Ford Hood, perhaps by bombing a restaurant outside the base. Abdo explained he was, quote, seeking revenge for what the Army did to me. Abdo's alleged plot comes less than two years after a shooting spree at Fort Hood left 13 people dead. The accused gunman, Major Nadal Hassan, who is awaiting trial, was urged to act by al-Qaeda cleric Anwar al-Awlaki. In Abdo's case, investigators see no signs of a broader plot, but it is a fresh warning that the threat of homegrown terror has not diminished. Bob Orr, CBS News, Washington.